All right, I'm now standing here with Tim Evanicki from Starving Artist Studios. They're actually a sponsor of Fringe this year and the Kids Fringe. So are you guys doing a program during Kids Fringe? Is that the idea? Uh, we have a Starving Artist Cabaret with Kids Cabaret every Saturday uh, at 2 o'clock. And we're also sponsoring the Got Talent competition, uh, which is a uh, multidisciplinary talent competition. Is it also um, part of Kids Fringe? It is part of Kids Fringe, yes. Absolutely. The preliminaries are the first three, well, Saturday, Sunday, Saturday, and then the finals are the final Sunday of Fringe at 5 o'clock. Oh, cool. So, like, just like a traditional talent show, you could bring any talent? A talent competition, yep. We can do anything. Juggling, we have stand-up comics, we have dancers, singers, uh, and what, monologues. What's the age range of that? Uh, 8 to 18. Oh, great. Excellent. So, uh, tell us a little bit about your organization. Uh, Starving Artist Studios is going to be opening in August, and we are a multidisciplinary performing arts school. Uh, it's going to be right here across the street from Lock Haven Park on the corner of Princeton and Mills. Uh, right now, it is the uh, Lock Haven Veterinary Hospital, um, and we are taking over both floors of the building. Um, we'll have 5,400 square feet of professional studio space, um, instructors for uh, classes for students ages 2 to adult professional. Uh, we offer classes in singing, dancing, acting, violin, drums, piano, guitar, um, all of the different disciplines in the arts. Sounds fantastic. Yeah. Do you guys have like a website or something? People we can go get more info? Yep, starvingartiststudios.com. And we also are going to be offering our studio space up for rental for local artist organizations. Great. Well, we'll check that out. All right, Happy Fringe. Thank you.